what both increases and decreases all at once? Time. It's one of life's great paradoxes. The more we spend, the less we have. We can neither own time nor buy it. And the more we try to hold on to it, the faster it slips away. Time passes by without notice. Each year we celebrate the milestone of getting a year older. We assume we have all the time in the world and sometimes, as the years go by, we see ourselves becoming more powerful and privileged because we've experienced so much time. We view the time we spend on Earth as an accomplishment when really, it's a dwindling resource. How often do you remember that time is running away from you, slipping through your fingers like water down a stream? As we race along our journey, we move further away from the source and soon the noontide of our days turns into the setting sun and from there we creep nearer to the dark night towards a solitary nursing place and the final eternal sleep. I just depressed the life right out of you, didn't I? Well, that wasn't really my intention, but I do hope that the significance of time shook you up enough so you're sitting forward in your seats and listening more attentively. Let me ask you, how have you spent the time in your life so far? Do you recall every precious moment or do you have a vague shadow of a reality that is constantly slipping away from you? Did time run away from you like the current of the river runs towards the waterfall at speeds too fast for you to fathom? Or were there idle moments when time seemed to stand still as you found yourself drifting into emptiness, wasting time as if it were a cheap piece of trash you could discard without remorse? Did you ever consider that time was an expensive gem to hold in your hands? One that you don't own and that you'd have to give back to some omnipotent master who questioned your every action? What price did you put on this gem? Did you dream that you might hold on to it even longer before being asked to return it? Do you dream about the future? Do you dream about the time you might earn tomorrow? And do you realize how it's like a promised treasure you have no assurance of acquiring? Time is the single most precious gift that we can give ourselves and the more wisely we spend it, the more we are able to reap its benefits. Even though time has no smell, no taste or feel and can neither be seen nor heard, it brings us to life as we experience the wonders of the world around us through the power of our five senses. Think of the time you enjoyed the gift of savoring different tastes, hot cocoa, on a cold winter day like today, sitting by a warm fire, crisp autumn ha apples handpicked from an orchard or chocolate syrup dripping over vanilla ice cream on a hot summer afternoon, certainly not like today. Recall a sweet moment when you sat back and listened to the sounds of nature, the cascade of a waterfall, the rhythm of the wind through the trees, the cheerful chirping of birds at dawn, Go back in time as you breathe in a familiar smell from a childhood memory. The aroma of grandma's chicken soup, turkey cooking in the oven, and apple pie Thanksgiving. The smell of chestnuts roasting on a wa fire, waffling from a nearby house as you walk down the street on Christmas Day. Remember the many gifts you've received over time? The comfort of feeling the presence of another human being beside you, the embrace of a loved one, the first time your child reached for your hand, and the time you felt broken and dejected, the soothing hug of a friend. When we understand the precious gift of time, we can then start to understand the miracles of life that unfold right before our eyes. The fiery sky at sunset, the crisp blue of the sea, caterpillar morphing into the beautiful butterfly. Time also rewards us in other ways. It teaches us how to become more resilient. We learn to crawl and within a short period of time, we're walking on two feet. And when we fall, we know that we can just get right back up and keep going. When we appreciate the gift of time, we learn the value of life itself. We create memories. We write stories that define who we are and who we are becoming, 
our interactions with others and our very existence. Now, as you take a moment to ponder the gift of time and what it means to you, remember to use it wisely. Because bit by bit, time, like water, is slipping through your hands. So stop. Bring your hands closer to you and feel the gift. Smell it. Taste it. And hear its magic as it runs through your fingers and back to the eternal source. Dream as if you'll live forever. Live as if you'll die today. Enjoy every second. Cherish every moment and don't let an hour pass without uncovering a secret or a day without learning something new. Be brave. Be present. Be kind. Be authentic, but most important, be yourself. This is the gift of time.